So I have a buttload of sweaters to show you guys. If you guys catch me in mid-rise or low-rise jeans, I'm going through a crisis and please call for help. Imagine just sitting next to Harry Styles and he brings you hot cocoa and you guys are watching like Twilight or something. I would wear that outfit for that occasion. What is up, boyfriends, girlfriends, and everybody in between? My name is Lexi. If you haven't seen my face before, go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And the nice comment shout out of the video goes to this person right here. Thank you so, so much for all of your kind words. They truly, truly mean the world. And if you want to be my next nice comment shout out in my next video, just leave a nice comment down below. Welcome to the video, you guys. As always, I am so, so happy you guys are spending this time with me. I hope everybody is doing well. And I am here today to do one of many fall clothing hauls okay I know my clothing hauls in the past not everything's necessarily super affordable this time around Zaff will reach out to me and they gave me the opportunity to pick a bunch of things off of their website to show you guys and I'm so excited about it before we get into this video I just want you guys to know that you guys can use the code 18 Lexi to get 18% off of your Zaffle purchase Zaffle is a very affordable site to shop a lot of cute clothes so without any further ado let's get on into this video the first thing I want to talk about is actually what I I'm wearing right now so I am wearing this really cute teddy cropped jacket I'll show you guys in the try on portion I'm obsessed with it you guys it doesn't have pockets but this coat is actually very very soft I have one in white that I have and it's actually still in Pennsylvania if you guys didn't know I am a college student I go to school at Lehigh University but I am doing remote learning for the semester because I had to evacuate campus so quickly and with such short notice I packed up as much as I could in two suitcases and came home haven't been back on campus in March and all of my fall winter clothes are at school in Pennsylvania so I'm really happy to have these clothes but I do have a jacket just like this literally just like this in white and this one is even softer than the one that I have so keep that in mind I really like this it's very lightweight but at the same time it's very warm I feel like when it gets colder out I would definitely throw on a long sleeve shirt under this if it was that cold outside I think it's really good for this transitional period between summer and fall I also am wearing this scrunchie in my hair Hair, and it's a very very big scrunchie I got them in a few colors I have this chocolate brown one here just so you guys can see like about how big it is and I also have one in black that I can't seem to find but I've been wearing it in my hair like every single day so I hope I find it but I love it I knew that I was gonna get passion twist and I needed some big scrunchies because all of my scrunchies are in Pennsylvania too and I have like so many scrunchies so I got these from the site and they are amazing they're satin I've never tried satin scrunchies before and I love it they don't snag my hair they don't make it frizzy I think it's great and the last thing that I'm wearing that's from Zaffle is this gold chain necklace. I just think it's really fun. Very lightweight. Obviously, it's not a good idea to get it wet because I am 100% sure this is not real gold. But I like the look of it. I think it's just something that I can throw on. Easy to style. Elevate to look a little bit. So yeah. Now that we have all of that out of the way, I am going to jump into some sweaters. Let's just get into the real fall stuff first. So I have a buttload of sweaters to show you guys. I think I'm gonna start with probably my favorite one that I got. It's this off-white cardigan and I just think it's so flattering on me. If you guys have seen any of my hauls before, you guys know that I really do like to shop for things that make me feel confident and comfortable in my own figure rather than trying to look good in things that I know aren't really made for the way that my body is built. And I have been loving that these cropped cardigans are so in style right now because I have a very short torso and these are are just very slimming but also very convenient I think that they make you look put together even if you aren't so I really really love this so much I think it's cute with a denim skirt jeans this is something that's so easy to style and while I was shopping I just wanted to make sure that I had things that would just be easy to kind of throw on but still look cute because even though I'm doing remote learning I do dress up as if I'm going to class every single day it is really good for my mental health and it just makes me feel better about myself so that's one of those pieces that I would love to wear remote learning with just some jeans, even leggings, a skirt. I also love the material. This was probably on the better quality side of the spectrum out of the sweaters that I received. I feel like everybody needs a black cable knit sweater. This one is this beautiful off the shoulder style and it's also cropped, but once you pull it off your shoulder, it doesn't really show your midsection, which I think is nice. I love this so much. I think that this would be cute in the fall or winter time once it gets really cold outside with some skinny jeans and a black thigh high boot. With it being cropped, it doesn't look too mature to where you look like an old lady. But then the off the shoulder aspect of it makes you look, you know, a little more mature, a little more 
flirty. Next up is this brown sweater. This is one of my favorite colors to wear in the fall and winter. I think that this just looks great with a bunch of fall makeup looks that I like to do. And it's just a really easy neutral to pair with black booties, brown booties, accessorize with. This is definitely a thinner sweater. I don't want to say that it's not good quality, but it is a thinner sweater. So I don't necessarily think that I would wear this once it gets really, really cold outside. But once again, I think it's great for the warmer fall weather and this summer to fall transitional period. So I love this sweater and it's just this crew neck, which I think it's nice to just have a basic crew neck sweater, but on the back it has this opening and I just think it's absolutely adorable. I will have all of the sizes that I got everything in linked in the description box because I really can't remember what sizes I got in everything because it varied for each item. But I will say, make sure that you check the size chart when you're shopping on Zaffle because in some instances, a large was like a US 8 or a 6 and I'm typically like a 4 up top, 6 down bottom, but sometimes if I want something to be a little looser, I'm a 6. So just make sure you check the size chart because it definitely isn't like accurate as compared to other US clothing sites. You guys are probably going to see this color on my Instagram a lot in the upcoming weeks because this is my all time favorite color in the fall. It's this maroon mock neck. What I call it? Turtleneck or mock neck? Not too sure. Maybe mock neck, but it's this maroon sweater and it is perfectly cropped for my body, okay? Once again, I have a very short torso, so things that are cropped are typically just like regular on me, but this is just the perfect crop for a French tuck or even if you don't want a French tuck and you still want to show a little bit of your abdomen when you're like walking around or reaching up, it is perfect. This hangs so beautifully. Once again, just a little bit of a thinner sweater, but I feel like if I just threw a long sleeve shirt underneath this, this would be good for winter as well. Sweaters are just so easy to wear in the fall. Fall is my favorite time for fashion and experimenting with new outfits and colors. So just once again, throwing this on with some jeans, a little shoe, a ballet flat, a boot, a booty, anything that you want, you can get. And yeah, I just love it. I think this is the last sweater that I have from Zaffle. And this is just something that was so fun. It's this Tiffany blue. It's on the thicker side of the spectrum. And I love the balloon sleeve. I love the cable knit detailing. And I also love this neckline. Now, when I was shopping online, I was thinking that this was going to be a little longer, a little more oversized, but it's actually slightly cropped and it's a pretty cute and flattering silhouette if I'm being honest. But on the model, it made it seem like it was like oversized and I'm pretty sure that that sweater was one size fits all or like they only had one size, just general one size. So I wasn't expecting it to be so short. So just keep that in mind. Um, I didn't feel comfortable calling this a sweater because this next item is actually like a tank top. It's this camel tank top with cinching in the front. I love that cinch ruched detail. I just think it's so flattering on my body, especially because once again, I have a very short torso and I like how it just molds my midsection. With high-waisted jeans, of course, you guys know I do not wear mid-rise or low-rise jeans. If you guys catch me in mid-rise or low-rise jeans, I'm going through a crisis and please call for help. This will be cute for the weather right now before it gets cold and before we start really experiencing fall. Next up is probably my favorite. Oh, it's so hard to say because I have a few other favorites that I'm going to show you guys. But next up is probably in the top three of my favorites and it's this beautiful flannel it says online that it's a coat but it's honestly just a thicker flannel material i would say it's very soft and sort of a fleecy vibe on the outside and on the inside i would say that it's not necessarily soft but it doesn't irritate my skin at all it has these buttons i can't remember what size i got this in i think i got it in the biggest size and i just think that this is really cute with some baggy jeans i love an oversized flannel with baggy jeans and sneakers i just think that's such a vibe and such a look. Also, the buttons on this are really cute and just big. A cute outfit idea would be pairing the top that I just showed you guys with this flannel. I also got this belt. It's just a black belt with a gold belt buckle. I have a black belt with a silver one and I wanted one with gold because I typically wear gold jewelry, as you guys know. And then this next item is a wrap dress. If you guys don't know this about me, I love wrap dresses. I love anything that wraps. I love anything that ties. I just love it so, so much. So it's this black polka dot wrap dress. I just think it's fun. Definitely 
definitely not like a satin or silky material I would say that I've seen a lot of things like this material at TJ Maxx It's not my favorite material, but I still think it's cute It doesn't irritate my skin or anything. It would just be nice if it was silkier or satin But it's not and I really don't mind. I love the ruffles in the front I think it adds a really girly touch I think this is one of those pieces that's just great for when you don't know what to wear You have no idea what to wear now. We're gonna get into lounge wear I have a few more things to show you guys this right here is this gray set that I have and I like this a lot the first time I tried it on it was a little snug obviously this is supposed to be like sort of fitting but it was snug and I was like I probably should have sized up I still feel that way I got this in a medium because it said that that was a US 6 I think and I definitely should have gotten a large I think the bottoms would have definitely fit more comfortably also something that I wasn't too fond of about this set probably because I should have sized up it might just be because I have a butt but the back is like lower than the front and so it's like irritating and then it like drags my panties down with it this might be TMI but like I said the second time that I wore it it seemed to stretch out a little more and I didn't really have much of an issue with it um I think this is a really cute outfit for a movie night or honestly anything of the sort just very chill also the top is long sleeve and once again it has this ruching detail which you guys know I'm obsessed with by now so yeah I love that and also I can wear this top with jeans or anything that's why I love sets because you can wear the tops with jeans or you can wear the bottoms with like sweatshirts or anything like that so yeah and then the next set that I got is the same exact material this one was really small you guys I got the same one in a medium I'm pretty sure the size charts were the exact same but this one was pretty small especially the first time I tried it on one thing that I do like about this one a little more than the other one is that it has these strings for you to tie in the front and I obviously love the color you guys know I love this color so much especially for the fall but this is kind of hot it's on the hotter side I'm not gonna lie this is definitely like a Netflix and chill outfit you know what I'm saying so the top is very very short I would never wear this outfit together outside of my house if I wore the top out I would definitely wear something over it but the top is very short like I'm saying if I don't pull it down it will show half of my boob short which is part of the look I think that it's definitely just cute flirty once again netflix and chill type vibe imagine just sitting next to harry styles and he brings you hot cocoa and you guys are watching like twilight or something I would wear that outfit for that occasion. Sweatpants, gray sweatpants. I got these from the men's section. I can't remember what size I got them in. It says I got them in a medium. They are definitely big, but they're like the perfect kind of big. You know what I'm saying? I also love that they have pockets in the back. I want to ask the manufacturers of these companies, why don't you think that girls need pockets? Girls carry around more things than guys do for sure. So I love the pockets on the back. They're so deep. It has this little thing on there. I don't know what it means. Hopefully it's not a cuss word. I doubt it is though. It also has very deep pockets in the front i'm obsessed with these i feel like they're just the perfect amount of baggy and just cozy and i would just wear this with a white t-shirt i would wear this with a black t-shirt i would just wear this to lounge around the house even go out and get errands with a denim jacket over top i love gray sweatpants and these are my first pair of gray sweatpants that don't have like a team name or something sporty on them so i'm very excited to finally have regular regular gray sweatpants and then the next thing is this cropped gray zipper hoodie i'm obsessed you guys i've been wanting the same exact thing from brandy melville for the past couple of years but you guys know brandy melville does that one size fits all bowl so i couldn't fit the one at brandy melville and i've been searching for a reasonable one because i mean who wants to spend this much money on a gray sweatshirt you know what i'm saying so i've been looking for a reasonably priced one that i can get in my size i think i ended up getting a large in this and it does fit like perfectly i feel like if i want any smaller it would definitely be too small but this is just so cute with just some leggings after a workout or something quick walk in the evening time in the neighborhood so I love that so much. All right, you guys, that wraps it up for this video. I hope that you guys got some inspiration for things to shop for this fall. Once again, use my code 18Lexi for 18% 18 off of your order on Zaffle. Make sure to follow me on Instagram. I've been super active on there. I post a lot of my outfits. I've also started doing outfit of the days every single day on my Instagram story. I'm gonna try and make that a highlight maybe tonight and like go through and add all those to a highlight so you guys can just tap through and see what you missed. I interact with you guys the most on there so yeah join the insta fam i am gonna go ahead and sign off but before i go i want to remind you guys to spread kindness and always remember that the less you wander the more you wonder i love you guys so so much and i will see you in my next video bye guys I know it